Hey ya, uh, it's Moneria here. In this video, I'll be showing you how I dyed my hair using Lee Say in the shade Soft Brown. And here is the expected color upon applying sa dark to very light and as you can see, very subtle lang yung shade. Then there instructions then outside the box. So let's see what's inside. This bottle is the solution too. And then this one is the pump. Ito yung instructions or manual na may gloves din sa loob. And then this one is yung hair treatment kapag i-wash mo na yung color. And then this one is the solution one na i-mix natin. On this part, I will mix yung solution 1 into the solution 2. And then let's close it and invert the bottle. So don't shake it. And then invert the bottle mga 5 times approximately. So, kita nyo, no? Very slowly and then gently ko lang siya ginagawa kasi we want to avoid forming the foam or the bubbles inside the bottle. So, after that, we will change yung original cap niya into the pump. So, this is the current state of my hair. I have highlighted hair and then nakikita nyo na tumubo na yung natural hair ko na black. But yeah, we will have a reference on bleach hair and then sa black hair. So gusto ko sana ma-achieve na kahit papaano maging subtle yung transition ng natural hair ko to the highlighted. Kaya parang gusto ko medyo pumantay na siya. So, yung nanay ko yung apply dito kasi gusto niya ma-make sure na pantay yung pagkakagawa. Pero supposedly, it's easy to use kasi nga parang ka lang nagsashampoo, parang ina-apply mo yung foam by yourself. Pero yan, sige, dahil nag-offer siya na help, tanggapin naman natin. And then, dahil nga gusto ko pumantay lang yung color and ayoko na masyado matakpan yung highlights ko. So, inuuna namin yung roots muna para mas mag color siya kasi nga super black na yung hair ko. With regards naman dun sa amoy, hindi siya ganun ka strong. Actually, medyo mabango pa nga siya. And then, medyo nangati yung ulo ko kasi I have pimples on some parts of my head. Kaya, yun, medyo makati or may onting hapde pero carry naman. So, important pa rin na to use the patch test na kasama dun sa instructions para sure na sure ka na okay sa hair mo. And then after makover lahat ng roots ko, uh, pinahiran na rin namin yung ilalim para pumantay naman yung color. So ayan, clean up na yung hair ko. And then, I waited for 30 minutes for the full effect of the dye. Parang itim. Let's see. Guys, ano po yun? Lalo na po siyang umitim. Um, kailang ano na ba tayo? I think naka 10 minutes na tayo. 10 minutes, 10 minutes, it's so dark. So, 30 minutes na po, no? At parang may namuong bagyo lang sa ulo ko. It's so dark. I don't think magbe-brown siya or what. Okay, hindi na ako aasa para hindi na ako masaktan. Hindi na ako aasa. So here is after I dyed my hair using Lise Soft Brown and as you can see, 
naging ashy gray yung kanyang effect sa hair ko. Lalo na on the bleach part or dun sa mga highlights. Talagang naging ash gray siya. Which I didn't expect dun sa um, soft brown. So yung transition ng hair ko from black to the bleach part is hindi na ganun ka shocking as kanina. At saka yung black hair ko naging soft brown nga siya. So very subtle lang. Pero hindi pa rin siya talaga yung nagpantay yung color ng black hair ko to the bleach part. So, pansin pa rin siya. Here naman, I'm showing you kapag when I'm outdoors or may tama ng natural sunlight para meron din kayong reference kung ano talaga yung itsura niya kapag nasisinaga ng araw. And then actually, sa personal, I think hindi mas kita yung hati ng black hair dun sa bleach hair. So in general, I think it's a good hair color. Just FYI lang on the ashy tones niya. And here's a side-by-side -side picture ng before and after for reference. Hope this video helps you and don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye!